Hi, Lonnie. Thanks for uh, taking this interview this morning. This is part of our Big Life interview series where we focus on people that live life to the optimum. So, Lonnie, you were born back in Iowa where you joined the Navy right out of high school to get out and see the world. Uh, what would you say was the single biggest benefit of your military experience? Well, uh, there's a lot of different aspects of it that uh, were uh, that kept it interesting, you know, from being able to see the world. I've seen 47 different countries. Um, and along the way, I was, you know, 17 years old when, when I went in, and by the time I got out, I when it was in my late 20s. Uh, and life was, uh, you know, uh, very interesting. Okay. Uh, while in the Navy, you were a gunner's mate and rescue swimmer. What was that like? Well, uh, the gunner's mate, I got to work on all the different types of guns. I got to qualify on every type of uh, military weapon there was in the Navy. And as a search and rescue swimmer, uh, I did a lot of training with helicopters, uh, jumping out of helicopters and then uh, into the ocean and, and doing rescues and stuff like that there, which was uh, very challenging. Okay. Um, you have always been athletic, wrestling and swimming growing up. Uh, once you got stationed here in San Diego, you got involved with martial arts. What style was that? That was American uh, uh, American kickboxing and taekwondo. Okay, and you earned your black belt degree? Yes. That's awesome, Lonnie. Uh, you are now out of the Navy and a field services supervisor for Time Warner Cable. I know you enjoy your work. Um, you've earned supervisor of the quarter numerous times as well as supervisor of the year. Yes, uh, I, I take it very personal when I go in to see each customer and I, I make them feel at ease and I find that niche that we can communicate about and it opens them up and they can let me know what the problems are and I'm able to resolve them. And, and that goes a long ways uh, when you're dealing with customers and customer satisfaction means so much. And, and I've always been very good being able to sell myself in that aspect. Okay. okay. Uh, you are also a proponent for giving back to your community, I know. What have you done lately in that area? Well, I, I volunteer on every, uh, well, this year anyway, I've volunteered at every volunteer event that we've had, uh, from Connect a Million Minds with the, the it's an initiative that Time Warner's pressed, um, which are trying to connect every uh, kid to math, science, computers, and engineering, uh, because it's fallen behind in, in the world. And so we're it's an initiative that we, we give back. So we show them how uh, we communicate you know, from satellite, from around the world, and how everything works together uh, in that aspect. Okay. Also, I, I give back to our own community, from community cleanups to uh, different things like that. They're, you know, uh, part of 1% uh, for the planet and things to that nature. So. Okay. Um, as far as your physical health, um, what do you do to maintain an optimal level of fitness? Well, uh, I've had my, my share of... Uh, uh, health problems through the years uh, and have some nerve damage and stuff like that there so uh, I, I'm not a big runner anymore so I have to do other uh, other things to keep me you know stimulated and to wanting to work out so recently I, I started doing uh, the insanity program it's a 60-day program to uh, try to you know uh, help you get back into shape and, and I've really seen a lot of good results in in the short time that I've been doing it okay well, cool. For you people out there watching this that don't know it, uh, Lonnie also happens to be my husband, and I'm very proud of his accomplishments. Thanks a lot, Lonnie, for doing this interview today. You're welcome.